Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. Today we will be making the most delicious chocolate cake. Guys, it is my son 11th birthday and this is what I made for him. Um, it is super rich and chocolatey and you guys just have to make this one, okay? Um, before we jump into this video, if you guys are new to my channel, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button, like, share, and comment on this video. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. So these are the list of our ingredients. I have some buttermilk, some flour, some coffee, sugar, cocoa, eggs, oil, baking powder, vanilla extract, salt, and baking soda. Now we will sift all the dry ingredients together, and this will actually be in the description box um, along with the measurements. All right, so we put everything together in a sifter, some baking powder, salt, baking soda, and we'll sift this together. We'll whisk and make sure everything is really well combined. So to our buttermilk, I just add some oil and some eggs, that is two eggs, vanilla extract, and we'll whisk everything together. Now to my mixer, with the dry ingredient, we will slowly pour the wet ingredients in. Then we will add the coffee, and this is fresh brewed coffee. Makes the chocolate even more chocolatey and super delicious. I am not a coffee drinker, but it tastes really good in chocolate cake. <laughs> so you guys definitely need to try this one. Make sure to stop the mixer and scoop the bottom. Make sure to bring everything back in the center of the mixing bowl. So it is done, everything is well combined. I would have already preheated my oven at 350 degrees and flour my baking pans also. And I'm using two baking pans because I'm making a two layer cake. So after 25 minutes, our cake is done. Looks amazing, nice and soft. We will leave this to cool for about 20, 25 minutes. Now we'll make our filling. So we added one cream cheese, one stick of butter, and that is one pack of cream cheese. And we will cream this, the cream cheese and the butter until everything is really nice and creamy. Then we will add our vanilla extract and our powdered sugar. Now I'm gonna make a chocolate ganache. I just heated some half and half, added in one cup of chocolate wafers, and I'll mix that until it's well dissolved, nice and glossy. Or you can just melt the chocolate in a microwave or in a stove top. Either way, it's good. And then we pour that into the cream cheese mixture. And you can add two tablespoons of coffee there also. Cream cheese filling smells, tastes, looks amazing. Now we'd apply that to our cake. And I'm going in with my second layer. Awesome. And then I'll put that amazing chocolate cream cheese right over the cake. I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect, but just make sure all over the cake is coated with that. You can make little swirls or, or however you would want to design this cake. It's just fine. The taste is immaculate, guys. You just have to taste this. Make it and taste it. So I do have some dark chocolate wafer remaining. And I'll just run that on the bottom of the cake to give it a little design. You know, nothing spectacular. It looks awesome. And there it is, guys, our delicious chocolatey chocolate cake. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, again, I would encourage you to please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Oh my gosh, that cake is super moist and super flavorful. Thank you for spending the time with me today. Do not forget to share, comment, and like on this video. Do enjoy. Bye-bye. See you on the next video.